Today I'll be showing you how to render TikToks in Sony Vegas Pro. First thing we have to do is go to File and then go down to Properties. In the template here, we want to look for HD 1080 60i. So this one right here. We want to change the width to 1080 and we want the height to 1920. So we just want to swap these over. I'm going to change the frame rate as well to double NTSC for 60 frames per second. And I'm also going to change the full resolution rendering quality to best. Resample mode, you always want that on disable resample. Go over to audio and then you want the resample and stretch quality to be at its best. Ruler, leave that as it is. Summary, nothing to do in there. And audio CD, you can leave that as it is too. Once we've done these settings here, you can go ahead and name the template uh, TikTok. Name it anything you'd like. Save the template, click apply. And as you can see, the video dimensions has changed in our Sony Vegas Pro. Now we can just click OK. Now we want to import our media. I'm going to use this GTA 5 gameplay here just for today's demonstration. Always click no for when this box appears. Do you want to set your project video settings to match this media? Always click no. Otherwise, if you click yes here, all the settings that we just um, made in our project properties will be useless and that would have been for nothing if we just click yes here. So always click no. Once you've loaded your clip into your video timeline here, you should see that the um, media here is in a different uh, video dimensions to our uh, Vegas Pro settings here. So in order to change this into the same dimensions as uh, our video properties here, we want to right click, go to the event pan crop. And then we want to right click in this video section here and match output aspect. And now as we can see, we've got no black bars on our video preview screen here. If you'd like to move the positioning of the video to something better, like over here or something, you can go ahead and do that. Just make sure you always have the enable snapping enabled here. Uh, lock aspect ratio, enable snapping, we want that enabled. Makes it easier to move around. Once you've sorted your clip and you've got everything the way you like it, now it's time to render it out. So highlight all your clip in the video timeline. Go to file, go to render as, go to the Magix AVC AAC MP4. And here we're going to select the Internet HD 1080p 60i. Customize the template. And in the frame size here, we want to click custom frame size. And once again, we want to swap over the width with the height. So in the width, we want 1080. And in the height, we want 1920. I also want the frame rate to be at 60 FPS, so I'm going to choose the 59.940 frame rate. If you're rendering out in 30 FPS, that's fine. Just leave it at its automatic 30 FPS setting, being that one there. But I want 60 FPS, so I'm going to choose 59.940. Leave all the other settings as they are. Also name this template to TikTok Render settings save the preset click ok and then browse to wherever you want to render your file to and just click render it's that easy to render a tiktok in your sony vegas pro if you found this video helpful at all please make sure to hit that like button for me and also subscribe for more future tutorials from myself thank you very much for watching